Hey guys, my name is Hannah and I am currently on a walk to see a waterfall called like High Force Waterfall I think. You can see the river kind of over there. It won't focus but basically we are on our way to Scotland which I'm very excited for. I managed to finally convince my parents to take us to Scotland for Easter. So I'm going to be doing a reading vlog while I'm here. It'll be kind of a mix between a reading vlog and just like a Scotland vlog. Alice is over here. Say hello! Hello! <laughs> I'm like a lion. <laughs> We're gonna go back. Yeah, okay. yeah. I've taken way more books than I know that I can possibly read because we are going to be doing a lot of hiking. I'll show you that later. <laughs> Our first mini hike, not really a hike at all because we're gonna get there really soon. But just wanted to tell you my TBR for hopefully. Wait, at least tell them where we're going. I've told them already. Okay. The books that I plan on reading while here, well, I hope to at least start reading them. Are... I still haven't finished I'll Give You the Sun from the Readathon. I'm sorry. I'm just a bit of a mess. We all know it when it comes to reading. Oh, our mess. I'm a mess <laughs> right now. I don't know. I haven't decided if I'm going to finish that or just go straight on to the next book, which is going to be the. No, not, not this one. This is no, the no, last no. one. No, no, no. I'm looking at your wellies. <laughs> My wellies. Good you today, Zella. Hey. The first book after I'll Give You the Sun is The Night Circus by Erin Morgenstern because it's Alyssa's friend's book. So we need so, to give that back. Yeah, we need to give that back. I'm also doing a buddy read with someone on Instagram. I'll leave her Instagram right there. She messaged me asking if I wanted to do a buddy read and at first I was like, oh god, will I be able to do it? I'll just get like stressed out, but no, I'm actually really excited too. Next, if I get that done, if I even get one book finished, Love Simon or Simon vs Homo Sapiens Agenda because as soon as it comes out in the UK on the 6th of April, I'm going to go see it with a friend. So I want to definitely read it before I watch it. And then, I know I'm not going to finish it, but if I do, you know, I've got Children of Blood and Bone by Tommy Adeyemi, 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 I do not know. <laughs> Mum, do you mind being in the vlog? I don't. Okay. <laughs> Everyone is raving about this, so what happened was with other books that I've gotten that people have been reading at the time, I got them, but didn't read them until like a year later. So I want to read this around the time people are still talking about it. So yeah, that is it. I will vlog a little bit of the waterfall and then the next part will probably be when we get to either our place that we're staying or to the next place that we're stopping off. I spy a waterfall. <laughs> Peppa Pig, Peppa Pig doing the hula. Peppa Pig doing the hula. Got some Scottish Man money. Shepherd. Scottish money. <laughs> They put locks next to the lock. And throw their keys into the lock. <laughs> it's actually day two right now in Scotland. I still haven't read a single page of any book. This is our second waterfall that we're seeing. My family love waterfalls, so anytime there's a waterfall anywhere, we go, we just go and see it. We have to, no matter how small or big it is, we go see waterfalls everywhere we can, isn't that right? Yeah. <laughs> Both look like lunatics because they're so cold. It's so freezing. It's actually so cold. I regret not bringing gloves. My I told you to bring gloves. Yeah, you did. I told her at home, Hannah, bring gloves. And she was just like, no, fine, I've got my pockets. And I was like, you're going to regret it. I said, I'm going to bring gloves for you, but then I couldn't find any others. And you regret it now. I do. <laughs> this waterfall is so pretty. Let me show you. Oh, my mum's saying to go over there. There are more locks up here. People just put lock, locks everywhere. Hey, Alyssa. <laughs> yes. <laughs> no, no, no. Okay, guess where we are right now? Ah, it's the Harry Potter bridge! I have a 
sounds nice in person. Are you kidding me? The actual bridge doesn't look as nice. This whole setting looks really nice. Fight me. Aisa? I've just been standing here for about five minutes thinking about how if you look you can really just imagine the Hogwarts Express just kind of coming along because you just like imagine it I'm standing here it's so huge in real life like this is just one of the arcs oh my god Alyssa on a massive tree stump and then boom it's the bridge and boom it's Ella Hello! <laughs> We're gonna go home now, it's like a four hour drive and who knows if I'm gonna get any reading done, I probably won't but I could try, you know <laughs> Just remember what happens, I know stays, I know. Look at Hannah run, who'd have thought it? Hannah's gone off to take photos, especially if I got her video camera. I mean, the fence kind of kills it, but the mountain is reflected in the lake. So pretty. Check that view. <laughs> if you like pina coladas. Ella, are you proud of Hannah's channel? That was a really sad, yeah. <laughs> yeah. If you like peanut colliders. We have a cracking hour. Uh, so why are you just filming the random stuff? Here comes Padre. I don't know, I just feel like it. Hey, Pa. Look at us. Oh, I'm trying to focus. That's so cool. cool. Was it cool? Look, literally wow. you can just see the clouds in the wow. reflection. <gasps> like, if you got rid of that, it would, you wouldn't be able to know. That's it upside down. I can't really get the camera to focus on it. I'll do it. So nice. We nearly drove away with our Hannah, yeah. Put that on your Insta. Insta. Hey, hey everybody. Seatbelts. One sec. Seatbelts. So Seat we can be safe. Oh, yeah. We got Pride and Prejudice. I can't focus this. How do you focus? Um, I'll do it. I got this edition of Pride and Prejudice. I think it's from the 70s, 1970. I don't know. It's annoying because it's it doesn't got to say be older inside. Because it doesn't have the um, thing at the beginning. Yeah. I've started reading it. I've got two other books with me, but I've started reading it because I love the movie so much. It's my favourite movie ever. And I already know that the book's gonna be great. Oh, the pictures in it. Right. Illustrations. Ooh. Damn. The gentleman did approach Elizabeth silently. That's so cool. This is the castle where Outlander was filmed. It's the first place that they came. Oh my god, that's so cool! That is so cool. Oh my god. What are you doing, Alyssa? Alyssa! <laughs> you can't crick. Oh yeah! Why not? <laughs> the castle! Castle Leoch. Hello. God, there's a Scottish flag How up there. How do you do that? Hello. <laughs> it's Castle Leo. What's that? From Outlander. That's where they filmed it. 
umbrella? Yeah. Oh my god, it's so big. Let me touch it. <laughs> That's crazy. It's so big and it's so cool. Oh my god. Oh, would you look at this? Huh, pretend, guys. Pretend I'm Claire. I should have curled my hair. It's the bottom. <laughs> it took me way too long to find this edition of Pride and Prejudice on Goodreads. The amount of scrolling down I had to do is a bit insane, but finally found it. Hallelujah. Like, three hours drive better be worth it. Here, Oh, this is so cool. I'll put your head in this one because this one's like. Oh my god, this is so weird. Okay, that's a story. Uh, what the hell? Okay. Oh my god. Can hear yourself. Watch them green. That's so cool. Oh, look, it's. Oh, Henry VIII. Oh, hello. Oh, there's binoculars. Why can't I see a thing? Yeah, Hannah, um, I can't see anything, guys. I'm so confused. Okay, I'll see you when I get out. <laughs> Hello, William. Will is the best name for a cat. Just Will is the best name in general. Oh, that's so adorable. Like, Alyssa just came and sat down for a second and his women as well. William loves me. 
Oh, he's so beautiful. Plus, I'm scared that if I touch him, I'll go away. So. I mean, I, I tried. I tried. Ellie, yeah, yours is better. really pouring with rain so I'm trying to make sure that my camera doesn't die so if you see my finger in the way I'm sorry but this is Fort William from Outlander and I'm gonna try to get around there's my mum running <laughs> but this right behind me is where it's Fort William so like Jack Randall's it's Randall's place and in the courtyard right through there we haven't bought tickets because that's too much money for such a rainy day. It's such a shame that it is pouring so much because I'd love to come home when it's sunny. But it's in there that Jamie was whipped in the show. It's really cool. Oh my god, it's so cool just seeing all the Outlander places. It's so awesome that they were filming here. It's so pretty. Oh, my camera's probably going to die if I keep it out in the rain any longer, so I'll talk to you when I'm somewhere dry. Somebody explain to me how this is spring. 